Welcome to my survival series for No Man's Sky. In the last part, we explored a paradise planet and found an ideal boast location, which I originally intended to build up in this part, but what, what's actually happened is there's something a little bit curious going on at the moment, and I haven't checked the journals, but the community mission seems to have disappeared. So I thought I'd come over and take a look at the anomaly and see what's going on. So the first thing we're gonna do is come and have a chat with Quicksilver. And we're just going to take a look and see what's going on. I'm just going to click here. Yeah, so that there's no new rewards. So I wonder whether there's an update or something in the offing. I'm going to go and check here. And, and of course, this is where you guys turn around and say that I've got uh, things here. Rescue stranded life form. Wonder the crop pod. Dangerous association. So there's still missions going on and that looks very much like some kind of community mission. I'm just going to be very curious to see out what this is. It says rescue a stranded life orb. Now this could go badly wrong but I'm just curious to find out what it is here, what is actually involved in this. Yeah so we're just going to start the mission and we're going to go off. Yeah so I do wonder whether there is actually an update in the offing. I mean, I must admit, I haven't checked the update uh, schedule for No Man's Sky. In fact, I've done very little checking on all the different games because the last um, week has been a little bit of a problem. Okay, so we've, we've got an, we've got a minute to leave uh, space anomaly. Yeah, the the last few day, the last week's been a little bit hectic, and I've got a little bit behind with what I need to do with respect to the channel. Apologies if my releases are a little bit disrupted. And I mean, I'm trying to work on launching a new series, but at the moment it's not working too well. So here we are, we're in a, you've discovered this. We've got a space station here. Last contact coordinates marked down there. So what we got here, okay, let's just go freezing planet. I mean, I'm half tempted to go up and just check the missions in the space station. In fact, I think I will. That doesn't look right. My freighter's here. This sent me to an existing system. Okay. Well, we'll soon find out. We're just going to dive in here. And progress save position at moment because we're in multiplayer mo mode. I just want to go and just take a quick look. I'm, I've always got stacked missions soon. Okay, let me just have a look. Browse missions. No. Take photo of a land dwelling creature. Well, we'll take that. That's, that's basically money for nothing. And deliver an item. Yeah, so we've got a mission here. So this is definitely a planet that I've... I've already found, so it sent me to my own planet, or a planet that I'm familiar with. Hey. Okay. Actually, there's one way to find out what we got here. So that's a quagmire planet. That actually rings a bell. Okay, what's happened to the mission? Uh, focus size, dangerous associations. Okay, there we are. So we're going to head for the stranded life form. Now this could be incredibly, uh, this could either be an incredibly easy mission or there's going to be something in it that's going to make life a little bit complicated. And seeing it's a multiplayer mission, I can't assume that it's going to just be drop down, talk to someone and leave again. I mean, if it is, it'd be a really nice quick win for 450 Quicksilver. Wow. Target planet reached. Yes, thank you. I mean, we're liable to probably land and get assaulted by all sorts of things, probably. So, there we are. So there's a ship there, and there's somebody just walking around. Getting a little bit of um, stutter. It seems to be increasing. I don't know what's causing that. Let's 
there's a creature there. We can take a picture of him. Go and I'll go and talk to this guy first. Okay, the Vakeen growls softly, drawing themselves up. The circumstances of the recent crash has made them distrustful. About a loan out here, their choices are limited. In despair, Engineer has shows me that their ship's shattered communicator control panel, control unit. The, this part is far beyond repairing. It could be potentially replaced. Okay. That means we've got to... Observes me as I approach the ship. Perhaps they could offer a clue about what occurred here. Okay. Search salvage containers for working communicator control unit. Oh, so they've actually... Oh, that's interesting. This could be quite a long mission, actually. <laughs> so we've got to look for salvage containers. Oops. Oops. What we will do is take a... Uh, Picture of a creature. We we'll just we'll, we got two here. We'll just right. So we got to find some. Oh, I, I, was, I thought I'd scanned all the. Why can't I? There's something. Let's just scan these. Um, scan you for the money. So we've got to find salvage containers. And I can't see any at all around here. Okay. That's a buried technology module. Oh, birds up there. Okay, so we're looking for... And we're going to have to kind of wander around a little bit. We'll see if we can get lucky. There's some... It looks like there's a salvage container over there. 244 away. I mean, it could be wishful thinking that we're going to find this on... very quickly, but... Uh, I mean, it could be. I mean, ever the optimist. We need to keep an eye on the oxygen, not the winter protection. So we're just going to get up here. I need to open this up a little bit and then stand well back. Actually, it's just because, of course, we're going to get possibly get attacked from these. Ah, Of course, the drones will come in and investigate. <laughs> I know they're investigating. That means I've got to kind of calm off a little bit now. Because he's kind of... I can't shoot really shoot him while he's hanging around. <laughs> it need life support's a bit low, so we can just chop back up a little bit as well. Okay. Let me just mining beam bolt caster reload just in case we get some more trouble. Let's just use the uh, we'll use the mining beam. Anyone else? No. So we got an encrypted communicator control. Is that is that what? 
Is that what we need for the mission? As the first person locate the part of the event. Analyze first locate the part in the inventory. Um, is that what this guy actually needs? Let me just... We need a navigation computer. That's not what we're looking for. Okay. Let's... Yeah, let's just analyze it. Decryption terminal located. Thank you, game. Decrypt the objective. Decrypt the salvage. I've just done that. Then return the decryption cable. Okay. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. It corrupted sentinels may try to reclaim the salvage part. Okay, let me just... Uh... Well, let's just go back and talk to this guy and see what happens. Um... Wait, can you get out of the way, please? I'm a little bit busy. Let's just go and talk to him. Um. I can't interact him. Him. There's anything else around here? So what we're going to have to do is go to the decryption terminal, aren't we? Where is it? Let me just get into the ship. Mine maybe we'll see it a bit better with the decryption terminal. If we can find it with the ship. I'm pretty sure that is um, I wonder if it's actually in the space let's just get up into space ah so it's there it is yeah I couldn't see it against the white background so we're just going to go to the decryption terminal so we'll just that up into here this looks like just a normal trade terminal. Of course, we're probably going to come under attack. Reload. Fuck the um they reload <laughs> Okay, so we defeated the number one coming all coming in quite quick. When do I have to keep deleting these or do I take the chance and try and just decrypt it? Um, we're going to go for the decryption. Terminal status locks and activity detected, so we've got to destroy them all. Okay, <laughs> keep it up, guys. We can, can we draw them away. Get in quick. That should do it. Terminal status active. Please present um, decrypt and criminal um, communicator control unit. Button pairing, key downloaded, syncing, device decrypted. Look at the replacement ship component. Thank you. I was certainly going to pick up these. 
yeah thank you game and i think and we can there's no point dropping a save because hey let's just jump back into the ship um just gonna take off ah i've just bashed there and we're just gonna fly back to our friend over there this is quite an interesting mission actually can talk to him again about where are you there we are let's go talk to him the keen growls softly drawing themselves up in the circumstances of the recent crash has made them there give him one communicator okay he's gone and he's Okay, like mission complete. That was, I mean, that was a relatively straightforward mission. But what we will do is just pick the slime up here. There's also some buried tech close by as well. Although I must admit, I was having to deal with our those corrupted sentinels was a little bit interesting. <laughs> Any more creatures around here? Oh, there's one there. You look a little bit like a predator. A patient hunter, yes. Okay. I don't think we're going to do another dioxide deposit. There's something over this way. Although, let me just see. What's that there? That's just kind of dressing. Right, what we're going to do now is just jump into the ship and... Uh, flying back to the anomaly. Not enough fuel for launch fuel. Well, wow. I'm actually out of launch fuel, but I've got quite a lot of uranium. I think in some ways uranium is actually better than the actual proper launch fuel. Because with uranium, you can do part refills. Yeah, it's going to come up here. And we're going to head straight for the space station. Oh my, it's not space station. The where's the anomaly then? There's no nexus here, so do we have to summon the nexus back in again? Okay, return to the space anomaly. Yep. And we'll just go over here and catch the mission in. Um, okay. Turn to the Nexus. Complete mission. And um, we've got a drop pod con coordinate data. And more importantly, we've got 451 Quicksilver. That was a pretty good mission, actually. I mean, we get another one. Let's have a quick look. A whole load of like five storm crystals. So at the moment we're not doing community missions. Okay. I mean I could go and spend some of my quicksilver with uh, um, on some junk, but I don't think I will. We're just going to do the usual now. Just have a bit of a whip round and see. Let me see. Give Flora. That should give me. Uh, hello. Give me another 400 nanites. Because we could talk to Mr. Cheapskate here, Ares. Um, health materials. Oh. I'm giving milestone data. That should give me 50. <laughs> well, 50 nanites is 50 nanites. Um, I'm. Just wondering whether I can get another suit upgrade. I've got the money for it and I've got over 20 million, so we could probably just whip in here. Yeah, and we we'll get another suit upgrade. I'd really like to get the suit upgrades finished. 
How much have I, I don't think I've got that much in the way of salvage tech. No, we've only got four. What we have got is some Yeah, I think we'll refine that. Because I've already got because this is related to that. We've got a fusion core that we can sell. That's left over from the missions last time. I'm not going to trade in the salvage data at the moment. And we'll just go out the very fast front entrance here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the space station and cash the missions up. And then that's what I'm going to call it for this part. Because I, I think I would like to keep this video self-contained. I don't want to go off and do anything else. Plus, it's actually Valentine's Day today, so I've got to be on my best behaviour. A whole day spent recording will not be appreciated. And of course, because we've now left the Nexus, we can now walk back to the other the system we were in before. And then we'll just blast the way through the asteroids pick up a little bit of junk on the way through of course that means we won't get a good price for the component because this is the system where we were given the reward anyway let's just get into here and it's going to jump out and of course we'll go over here and see what we can find or give in that's probably the correct term turn to the mission agent yes i know i think killing all those sentinels was a uh, quite a little bit of bonus in its own way because i had quite a lot of missions to kill sentinels so just come in here and in missions oh we only got four but this is another fifty-seven thousand increases our Standing with the Corvax. Um, a photo of creatures that gives us some more nanites and increases our standing with the Viking. Relatist Art Crystal. Yep. And we've got increased our standing with the Merchant's Guild. And we've got another 64,000. So in some ways that's helped uh, offset the cost of the upgrade. Nothing in there that we can do anything with. Uh, we'll just come over here and see if we got a good price on what we've got here. So, uh, got here. I want to sell. The, I want to keep the cadmium. We got two drop pods now that we can carry on using those to work on upgrading things. So. Of that so yeah the fusion core is still minus 11 so we're going to keep the fusion cores for the moment and we've got quite a lot of pugnium i don't want to go over the top of the pugniums just over 100 119 to do what that should do is stop the overflow into this area here and what we got here I think for the moment I'm going to put the rusted metal into the high capacity because we're going to need that for building the base and really I need to drop this stuff off as well. Got runaway mold here. Let me just pop that back into there. Pick you up. 203. Pop you up. Get that converted then we can convert this into nanites. A little bit of dihydrogen gel. Um, I wouldn't want to put the indium into the high capacity as well for the moment. A little bit of gold. There's a, I think if we go to the ship, there's a. We can go to. And that to the exosuit as well. I think the gold has gone directly into here. I mean, the game can be a bit odd sometimes. That sometimes it puts it in the high capacity, other times it doesn't. And I think that's got everything nice and tidy. And they come out here, All right? I think just one more thing to look at before I wind the video up. In 
Actually, I'm just going to drop a save just in case. Oh, we are now an adjutant with the Vakeen. Because one thing I would like to do is start doing derelict freighters, but I can't remember offhand how we start that process off. And let me just see here. Acquire coordinates. If I pay five million for this, what will it give me? It hands me a small radio device, even if I take it, they turn away, the transaction is over. Yeah. That's what I thought I was going to get, an emergency broadcast receiver. I was, I was a little bit worried that they may kind of send me on it directly. And I think once I've done the first derelict mission, then that triggers us being able to get the weekly reward inside of the Nexus. But I think this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.